Hey guys, welcome back. On the last video, we ended up installing Unity Hub. Now in this video, we're gonna make a brand new project and we're gonna see which version of Unity we're gonna install to actually make that project. So let's open up the Unity Hub. As you can see, I have zero projects. And if I click on the Installs tab, you can see that I have one version of Unity installed, which is a 2018 version. It's 2018.4.14 F1. Now, the reason I picked this one to download is because it has long-term support, meaning that this version is always going to be the most pampered. You know, it's always going to be supported. So if there's any packages within Package Manager that keep being updated, they're going to be updated for this version also. So uh, that's a good sign of relief. So let's say you don't have this version and you want to download it. Just click on the download tab or at least the add tab right over here. Once you do that, it's going to show you this window. You're going to see latest official releases. Now the versions that they're showing you right now might be a little bit different. That's cool. As long as you get an LTS version, because we're basically going to be going over the bare bones. So it's nothing out of this world. It's features that should be in any version of unity. So we're just going to be going over the basics. So we're going to be going for 2018.4.14 F1. Now let's say if you don't see it in the list and you want to go along with my video, click on download archive and you can search for a specific version of unity. So you could use the hub to download it. You could download it separately and then locate it and then add it to the packages. All right. So, um, I already have mine downloaded. Let's say if, uh, if you found yours in the list, just look for it. Click next. It'll start installing it. Well, it'll download it, then install it. Once you know it's done, it'll show up under projects. You'll see this little drop down menu. You'll click on that. And as for myself, I have 2018.4.14 F1. So we're going to make a project on that. Now for you, it might look a little bit different. You might not have this VR lightweight uh, render pipeline. I think they gave it the boot, but you are going to see lightweight, but it's going to be renamed as universal. So you'll have high definition render pipeline and you'll have universal. We're not using any of these because we can add these later. So we're just going to be going for an empty project. I'm going to name my project Uptown Tutorial. Click on create and close this out. Now we're going to be going over the bare bones on the next video, meaning how to navigate around the software, how to add items, how to basically start building out your level. So if you like, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell. So you'll be notified whenever I drop a new video and there you go. All right. Now this is the basic UI. It's very simple. It's very down to earth. If you're not seeing exactly what I'm seeing, you can always go to the upper right click on layout, click on revert factory settings, just in case you were messing with it before you want to put it back to the way it was, click continue. And there you go. All right. So like I said, guys, hit that subscribe button and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.